APS Metro Individual Medalist. How does that feel? Really good. Like a huge confidence booster right now. Going into district and state, it feels really good. Well, on your score today, was it what you expected, high or low? Um, you know, I didn't set anything walking into this tournament. It's more of my main goal was, can I hit greens? Can I hit fairways? I don't want to chase birdies. It's more of, can I make par every single hole? Can I hit fairway? Then can I hit the green? Can I at least two putt and maybe a birdie here and there will fall? So I didn't come into this round very selfish. I didn't want to feel selfish about this round just because I know the second I do, my mental game takes over. And a couple holes today, my mental game did take over because I did triple and double a par five today. But all I had to tell myself was basically, it's shot by shot. And you have to make every shot count. It's not, it's not good or bad. You gotta let go of the bad and play the good. So that's kind of how I played my round today. <laughs> Uh, you just described how you were kind of keeping track of yourself and your score and you're being nice to yourself. Were you able to keep track of the other's scores and who was chasing you and where you were in the tournament as far as uh, leadership? Um, no. I try my best going into tournament not worrying about where I'm placing because I know if I can at least steady myself out and play par golf, all the numbers will fall into place. And that's really about just consistency. And I know the second I look at like the leaderboard and all the scoreboards, it's gonna like mentally just corrupt my brain <laughs> and be like, all right, I need to chase birdies now. And I shouldn't think I need to chase birdies. I should be thinking, can I get fairway to the green and two putt and maybe a birdie will fall. So not playing selfishly, again, helped me a lot today and not worrying about people around me. I have to worry about myself when I play golf. And I learned that this past couple weeks in mental training. So it's really helped. <laughs> how was the course? Uh, cold this morning, kind of nice by noon. How was the course playing? It was beautiful. Greens were a little slow, but a lot better than last tournament because they just punched the greens and sanded. But playing conditions were really good today. And what's next? I have district, then state, and I'm off to college. <laughs> College, where are you going? I'm going to Adams State on a golf scholarship. To be what? I am going into the medical field, so I want to be a regenerative medicine doctor, so a stem cell doctor. So natural medicine, basically healing the body with your own bodily fluids instead of putting chemicals back into your body. Interesting. So are you practicing? Are you in practice with some of those methods now? And how does if so, how does that improve your game, or how do you think it improves your game? I am. A year ago during COVID, I tore a hip muscle and a ligament in my hip, and I tried regenerative medicine, and my ligament actually reattached itself, and that saved me from sitting out a year of golf plus extra training if I went through surgery. So my ligament regrew itself and reattached itself, and now I have no pain whatsoever. So that improved my probably my golf game by at least 70 percent so that's what interests me and put my interest into going into back to the medical field great uh, it's nice that golf is a game that can provide that for yes. you too yes it is. um so let's see state is up next and uh what year are you are you a senior i am what senior. uh your previous finishes in the state um my freshman year i took 10th and my junior year, which would be last year, I was fifth. I was the fifth finisher. And this year? This year, I'm hoping for a higher finish, but we'll see how the numbers fall. So, again, gotta work shot by shot, hole by hole. You never know until you finish that 18th hole where you're at. Thank you very much. Anybody you wanna thank? Um, I wanna thank both of my golf coaches, Coach Gonzo and Coach Montoya. They have been with me throughout this season and teaching me. I wanna thank Jerome. Jerome has, um, has been one of my biggest mentors this year and has put me on to mental training and target practice. And I thank all of them for that. And I don't think I would be sitting right here with you today without them. So thank you guys. <laughs> uh, sophomore. Sophomore, so you're the APS individual medalist this year. Yes. Congratulations, how does that feel? Uh, feels great, you know, coming out here and shooting a 
good score, felt good. You know, coming off of the last couple rounds, they haven't been my best, but I was able to chalk up a couple swings and get a, get a win. How was the course today? It was cool this morning, warm by the time you got around to the end. How was the course? Uh, it was in good shape. You know, the, the wind started to come back after the play ball at the front nine, but I was able to hold it and make some putts. But the overall condition of the course, uh, it was perfect. I got no complaints. Individual score, where does it rank as far as your best and how you were hoping to perform today? Uh, I was hoping to do a little better, but uh, not my personal best, but um, you know, I'll, I'll take it when I can get it. So what's next? Uh, state. Hopefully uh, I can get individual and team champion. Well, good luck, congratulations. Anybody you want to thank, say hi to? Uh, thank you to my mom and dad, you know, you guys have always been supported. This game was scheduled for 9 a.m. and we rescheduled it to the afternoon. But can Dalton Shilka stay alive? Oh, that one's a little long. And that does it. Game set and match in favor of Cameron King. Two-two pitch. That's well hit. It might be trouble. No. Sliding catch and right by Noah Morlock. That's a hit past the pitcher. And just like that, we'll have another runner come in. And wow, just like that, La Cueva strikes again as Melania Macias comes in. Oh, two. Line the second for the double play. Leadoff base runner erased. He was straying a little far on a line shot to the shortstop long, and he turns and tosses it to Padilla for the double play. What? The second serve from Boson. He's in. Cross court action going on at this point, and it pays off for Boson. Make him make a play. There is the bunt, popped it up again. Long run, Cooper, and he's gonna make the play. Catchers showing off their leather in this one. I'm out of it. In off the hands, right at Karras. He's gonna short hop, scoop that, and turn the double play, maybe? Yes! Whoa. Double play! Karras let that one drop, and then a really tough hop. He certainly did that on purpose. Wow, that's a shot. Wow, that'll do it. Oh my gosh. Man, a shot to center field over the fence for Genesis Hadamil. And that's it, man, 10 to zero. Bears with the hot bats right now. He is bunting. Got it way in on the kitchen there. And a great diving catch by the catcher, Trujillo. What great play, what great hustle by Trujillo right there. That's well hit to Cooper. It is high. It is deep. It is showing an in-flight movie. Home run, David Cooper.